Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And for the people who are already subscribed to my channel, welcome back. Much love. So today's video, I will be showing you guys a braid out plus a step-by-step -step how to install the new Tim Port wig from um, Innovative Weaves. And yeah. That's basically it. So you guys, this is the first wig that requires no leave out. This wig allows you to wear your own repart hair. So there are no webs to cover up this wig, as you can see. So there's no webs to cover it up. The great thing about this wig is that you don't have to worry about blending your leave out. You don't need to deal with lace glue, bleaching the knots, tape, none of that. Or trying to, or to cover up little holes in your lace frontal. This wig cap is super duper light. As you guys can see, it's 100% breathable. If I pull this wig apart, you can just see the holes in this wig. And this is great because this prevents you from having a sweaty and itchy scalp. So that's a very, very great benefit of this hair. So that's all the things about this hair. I will link all the information on how to get this hair and which hair I got. I will link everything in the description box down below. So make sure you check that out. I also have a discount code which is ANGEL10 and yeah let's jump right into install it this way. As you guys can see if you look closely you can see that there's like a tiny row that hasn't got any hairs on it and, and on this um, tiny row that you got there's where you're going to apply your pins. You only need three pins on each side and I will show you guys I'll do one side to show you guys how to apply these pins so going to come a little closer <laughs> so obviously you want the front part to be tied to your head so this is the part so this is the part and this is where you're going to put your pin through just like so so that's one then a little bit towards the middle i'm going to add another one right here right there i'm going to add another bobby pin When you have those three pins right here, when you place these bobby pins in your hair and you pull it tight, you're supposed to be you're supposed to be only left with the hair. So this will give you the effect that the hair is coming out of your scalp. So I'm quickly going to apply the rest of the bobby pins through this hair, and I'll be right back. So you guys, I'm back and I finished um, applying all the pins into this hair. The important tip is for you to tease the roots of this hair. So I know I've been doing it a lot on the side of my head and the reason for this is because I prefer a side part. So yeah, so I'm gonna, now I'm going to apply this wig. So I'm gonna take this wig, put this on my hair, make sure it's all secure. So I'm first gonna take the, the comb in the back actually. I'm gonna put it through my braids. Then I'm gonna take the two um, adjustable straps. I'm going to connect those. And I'm going to attach the combs here in the front. So I want it obviously to be here so what i'm going to do is take first so i'm first going to attach the front one and i'm going to take the second pin and the same with the last one just like so let me fix my hair a bit here yeah, because my part is so messy and now I'm going to take these and place them back. So you guys, this is how it's looking so far. I know you can see the pin still, but that doesn't matter because I'm going to tease the roots. So I'm now going to jump into taking out my braids.
so you guys just like so oh god this spread out turned out so cute they're really there but back to the party i'll come back to fluffing it out and doing whatever so now i'm gonna take um the roots and tease them just to cover up some of the pins anyways i'm just gonna take the hair and just pull it down So, and I know my hair is a bit messy here in the front, but I'm going to lay that right now using some edge control. And this is what your hair should be looking like up close. It really makes me feel like this hair is coming out of my scalp. I'm going to leave it like this this time because I don't want to do the behind the ear thing because I already did that in my last couple of videos. So yes you guys, so this is the finished look. yes you guys so this is the end of the video i hope you guys enjoyed don't forget to like share and subscribe share this video with your friends let them know what your god is doing on this channel hey and i will see y'all in my next video